53.6 kilometre an hour average over the last 20 minutes and it's only going to get faster from here on through to the finish and a very small compact bunch of the front the rest just just riding to just hang on to try and keep the same time as the rest so Alperson de Koenig in charge at the moment Caden Groves sitting up there in third wheel in the green on the right hand side of picture Walt Van Aert now it's him and Eduardo Wafini and it's Wafini's job there he is in the yellow he's still on the wheel of Attila Volta who's doing a very very good job of Van Aert there he is in the red Van Aert so Wafini is actually riding on the wheel of Van Aert at the moment waiting for when he's needed this is that sharp corner 2.4 to go here we go. Caden Groves in a decent position at the moment, still waiting to just take a vault forward. GC Man, you saw them clearly at that last squeeze, just easing back a little bit. A uh, bit of picture break up, but uh, solid right now, as is, of course, Attila Volta whenever he's called it to duty. That's for Visma Lisa Bike. Doesn't want to be leading in uh, Alps into Koenig and almost drifts to the side of the road, as if to say, uh, uh, <laughs> apologies, fellas, it's now your turn. They hit the front. Green yeah. jersey is on display with Caden Groves tucked in, just looking for the red jersey. As you but I can't quite see him. In fact, he's absolutely there on a tow rope, screened by the big form of uh, Caden Groves. And here we come through the little shilly shallies right now. Another roundabout to be dealt with. There'll be one at 850 metres to go. And then we have that little so almost chicane section with about 600 metres or 500 metres to go. As Campanarts decides to take off uh, on his case almost immediately, Arna Marit decides that he wants to go and join the party. Can anybody else sit, indeed come and have some fun? Let's wait and see. Uh, Marit, uh, it's B Vitor Breit from Intermarche who just hangs back a little bit, allowing Marit to go up the road. He's supposed to be his lead-out man. He's on other duties at the moment. He's on help himself mode. 1.5 kilometres to go. Caden Groves uh, uh, team ups into Koenig, uh, putting out fires at the moment. That fire has been set by Campanards. If you wouldn't let me in the break, then I'm going to break your spirit at this point. Fabulous demeanour by this man. He's determined, Sean, to have a go. Yes, well, the perfect uh, timing there just uh, hit it when it was a little little bit of a maybe a lull the sprinters teams and their domestics just are holding off and uh, you know try and taken by surprise where we can see Elvis into Cornick are the ones who are starting to close it down here and still a kilometer to go for Kalpernatz is not going to be uh, big time big turn for him and uh, it, it's an opportunity to almost slingshot off the curve here track cycling styly and indeed that gap is eaten up and Campanazzi is not going to have some glory today but how much have they spent here Alps into Koenig in this endeavor there's the green jersey they're coming up uh, thick and fast here uh, uh, Marit and Brait now uh, just getting themselves into position they, they'll be able to see the line there's a little shimmy don't forget still with about uh, 400 meters to go but their tongue hanging right now and Abra story and got some man in for Uskadel in the orange are also coming to play the game and here it is it's a big open lead out right now Herman's doing a fantastic job on his back wheel uh, Caden Groves he's Van almost uh, up to speed right now and there is Van Aert he's in the frame here Corbin Strong also wants to play the game but he's out of position I'm afraid for just for the time being a big drive here by the man who wears the red jersey but Groves is coming back in the miss he no gets there phenomenal stuff well Van Aert makes it home Abra story very fast finishing on the round here almost knew instinctively which side of the road to go that was a piece of class